Hi everybody, it's Nicole with Stargazer Soaps. I am going to make a summer soap. I am making watermelon. And I'm really excited about this. And my lye solution. I have a couple of soaps to make today. And I have plans for both of them. And I'm really hoping that they turn out the way I am envisioning in my head. But so many times that is not the case. Make sure you can see. that emulsified for now and add my cream I have no idea what this fragrance is going to do if it's going to accelerate or not, I should have looked. The uh, fragrance company that I got this one from doesn't really, this is not the right fragrance, doesn't really have a lot of information on the fragrance oil. So I think I'm going to play on the safe side, separate my colors first, because I want to get some layers in this. I want them to be pretty straight. So this first one is white. I'm just going to do just a little bit of white. And then some green. I'm wondering if I want just a smidge more in the white. I just want a really fine layer, thin layer. All that good. Okay, so I'm going to start with the green. Actually, I'm not. Yes, I am. That's not as bright as I want it, but this this green is funny. It's um, it changes. And I have to remember that it does that. A little bit of the fragrance in there. A little smidge it more. Let's see what it does. So I don't know if you can tell, but it looks like army green right now. It's not going to stay army green. And I'm going to get this a little thick. So I can use it for the white. Wipe off my table. Oops, I almost knocked a ton of stuff on the floor. I'm in the process of reorganizing my whole office. So my office is where I soap. And oh, that, oh yeah, that's enough. Okay. I really don't have the space to be soaping right now. I really don't care. I just, my supplies came in today and I want to soap. But I've been making stuff like crazy lotions and bath bombs and more body butters. I finally have a lotion recipe that I am extremely happy with. 
So that will be launching very soon. I just made a whole bunch. Well, that's like... Man, I wanted it thick, but that is really thick. Let me spread this out here. I have to keep reminding myself this is not the color it's going to be. It's not the color it's going to be. Because I really don't like the green in this stage. Make sure my sides are nice and clean. Oops. I hope you can see what I'm doing. I'm going to smack this down. That's like solid already. So apparently this fragrance oil it does accelerate trace. Because I'm banging it and nothing is happening. So I'm just going to try to spread it out a little bit. have a little bit on the sides, so but it's not a big deal. I plane the edges anyway. Okay, get that out of the way. And now I'll do white. I think I'm gonna need more white though. So I'm going to pour some more in here. It really is just a guessing game and I'm really worried about the next soap that I'm going to do if I'm going to portion it out right. It smells really good. Okay, so that's nice and fluid. And hopefully that will thicken up significantly while I work on the next, the last piece. Let me clean off my spatula. I don't want green in my red. Oops, I cleaned it off and then laid it right back down in the green. This is starting to thicken up a little bit, but that's okay. And in my color. I stopped recording. Hopefully it was just a few seconds ago and you saw what I did. I just added in 
my um, pink mica, my watermelon. It's kind of a reddish pink. I didn't want it to be pink pink because you know watermelon is red. Actually, I think that's going to be pretty good. And I don't think I'm going to stick one this anymore. Get that rinsed off for the next batch. And I have poppy seeds that I'm going to add in. So the poppy seeds will add some character and then some exfoliation as well. Looks so cool. Oh, good. And the rest of the fragrance oil. This fragrance oil is kind of a lime green color. hand is getting tired. I've been working with my hands all day today. I just want to make sure this is blended really well. I don't want any fragrance oil pockets. So making sure my white is set up. Just test. Oh yeah, it's pretty solid there. I'm just gonna start pouring it thinly so that I can make sure that it's not gonna break through. That's my Jugs are in the way. Scrape this out. And that set up pretty fast. So I didn't check a cure date. Shocking. I was just so anxious to soap. Kids are at school and my little one is taking a nap. So I wanted to take advantage of the quiet while I could and the no distractions, and I just... Although I never think about the date until... Whoops. And I almost knocked over, just fell over. Anyway, I never think about the date anyway until I am in the middle of soaping. I know it'll be June. It's probably going to be mid-June. I'll definitely post it down below. But I was thinking this would be perfect for 4th of July. Oops. I have some um, new dowels that I want to use here, but I can't get it open. Scissors. Sorry, I know this is extremely exciting right here, isn't it? But this is real life soaping. Can you even see what I'm doing? Not really. A little better there. Now 
I'm trying to decide if I'm going to add glitter. I think I might do just a light, light dusting. Although it almost doesn't need it. I could have left it flat and not textured the top at all. I just planed all the edges, but I didn't. All right, just a smidge it. I mean, there's barely any glitter there. So there's watermelon soap, and uh, don't go anywhere. I will post the cutting video to the end of. This one. Okay, here is watermelon. Can you take that, please? Thank you. Let's send it on here. There we go. Sample pieces. Let me see if I can focus. That's a little better. You can see the poppy seeds in there for the watermelon seeds. This smells really good. What do you think, girls? I love it. I like how it's inside. It's just like watermelon inside. You think it looks like a watermelon? Yeah. It's really cool. Does it make you want to take a big bite? Yeah. yeah. Well, you probably shouldn't, though. Mm -hmm. I know, because Cause what does it soap. taste like? Soap. soap. Yeah. One of my girls one day said, it smells so good, I just want to lick it. And she did. And what did it taste like? Soap. Yeah. <laughs> she said soap. <laughs> and it looks like it's a real watermelon right now. Oh, good. And the seeds inside. I'm glad you like it. So this will be cured June 23rd and will be available on my website at stargazersoaps.com. Thanks for watching. Bye! Bye.